Hello, St. Patrick's Day 2011 again here at Happy Dog Farm, second installment for the day. Uh, I'm with Larry, Curly, and Mo. Larry, Curly, and Mo are my trap trees that are behind me. Um, I use them to experiment on for pruning, for traps, um, because they're here. They are apparently wild apple trees, and they've done pretty good. And I, they don't look like they were intentionally planted. They're three distinct different varieties of apples to bear fruit. Um, so I quite like the three of them specific. But they're here and they were free lab rats. So looking at Larry and Curly here and, and Mo, I don't really know who's who yet. They haven't told me. Um, you can see my uh, ball traps left over from last year. I took down the pheromone traps and I will replace those. I trap for, um, I use pheromone traps for oriental fruit moth and for codling moth, oriental fruit fly and codling moth, something like that. Anyway, and they, uh, it, it's interesting to see what they bring up. The, the ball traps really seem to pick up everything. Uh, I have more. These need to be scraped, cleaned, and replant, put out here again. It was just kind of easier to leave them on the three trees. So there you go. Uh, for those of you who are interested, our weather's been, you know, kind of winter-like. You can kind of see where we're at now for buds. These are all high, and one reason they're high is because, again, the deer pressure. But not a whole lot's going on yet in terms of the buds. Water shoots? Yeah, I left a lot on, and I trimmed a lot off. Um, I'm selfishly thinking that if these bear fruit again I can remember who bears nice fruit then those shoots or parts of them will become cyan oh forgot sorry will become cyan for the next year and I'll try to graft them so yeah there are a lot of water shoots I say that without shame and also some of these entire limbs may get replaced with fresh wood as time goes on so click um, Again, they're, they're learning, they're coming into their own, but nothing's really happening yet. Uh, these two trees are markedly different than this one. So I gotta watch a Three Stooges movie to um, figure out how to name them. I'm not sure if these are two distinct trees that have wound against each other from seed, or it just split, but you can kind of see what's going on down here and they split up. I got a lot of dead wood up there, but it's kind of dangerous to get up there with the chainsaw. So I need to come up with a safe way to get up into the tree and to trim some of those limbs off. Uh, hopefully to mitigate any disease that may be coming down. Uh, <laughs> that certainly does look like what people tell me fire blight looks like, as old as the trees are. I'm going to try and give you a better shot, but you can see it's black. It's rather unnice. So, anyway, that's Larry, Curly, and Mo on St. Patrick's Day 2011.